Can't wait until it's time to play ball, huh? Boy, I'm, we're all missing baseball. A local coach is making sure that his team stays sharp by posting virtual drills. Well, he's using Facebook, he's using YouTube. Here's a touch. As a young kid with two strikes, you have to learn how to at least put the ball in play, okay? You'll be able to start ripping your swing as you get older and you develop a pure swing and it's muscle memory. But you're still learning at these young ages. And when I say young ages, up to 13, 14, even some 15 year olds, it's crazy, but it's true. So with two strikes, we have to go into protect mode. Maybe move in a little bit, maybe choke up. I hear guys yell, two in, two up. You know, it's, again, cliches, but it kind of makes sense. Get in there and protect. All right, coach, how's it going? Uh, of the I'm Philly good. Royals, well, uh, welcome to the show. Thanks, thanks for having us on, we're really excited. He's over there in Burlington <laughs> County. Uh, with his seven-year-old. What, is that Jude? That's Jude right here. Here's the internet star right here. Hey, Jude, what what's Jude going on? Hi. So, hi. hello, Jude. Hey, Jude. How many times have you heard that in his young life? <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, uh, my God. Uh, well, so what all will you do? Will you do, uh, like, uh, grounders and stuff like that? I guess you can't do pop flies, but certainly batting as well. I mean, basically what we're doing is the, the premise of this was everybody doesn't have teeth, everybody doesn't have, um, you know, stuff they can go out back and use, regular hard balls and bats. So our idea was let's do it around the house where, you know, mom doesn't get mad at anybody, we don't break anything. So we're using simply, you know, sponge balls, we're using wiffle ball bats, and we use our cones as our bases and our, um, our props. So that's basically what we've been doing, and having our little room here, our little 10 by 15 room, and getting work done. So, so it's been great. Do, what do you use? Do you use Zoom? Do, can you have a lot of players on at once? So we, uh, we're just starting to get into Zoom. It started just as fun with Facebook Live. We didn't realize it was just oh. supposed to be for our club. You know, we have about 60 players on our club. And uh, next thing you know, I didn't realize that Facebook Live is public. So next thing you know, we, had, you know, we were getting up to a couple hundred views per video. So it's been interesting. So, but today's the first time we're using Zoom with you guys, so we like it, so we're going to try it with our team. Tonight. Yeah, you should. You get a lot of players on at one time. We're looking at a little bit of videotape. Can you th th roll a grounder to Jude to see if he's got some skills? Yeah, so basically what we do is in the house, we get our sponge ball. We have Jude down between the codes. We set two codes up, and we're just rolling balls with bare hands. Work with your hand-eye coordination and how to field it with your hand over top. Catch it low, hand over top. So we'll do a couple to Jude. He just gets it, gets it back to me. It's just all hand-eye coordination. Go get the ball. It's pretty simple stuff, but this is stuff that really pays off when he gets in the field. It's all technique stuff. All right, so that's our defensive stuff. So we'll do, you know, 50 to 100 of them a day. And you can see when we get out onto the field, he's really sharp with his ball already for a seven-year-old. What age group are we talking? So Jude is seven. Uh, he's been playing seven-year travel ball. Come on up, Jude. Jude's been playing seven-year travel ball since he was five. Um, I have teams all the way up to 15, 16 year olds, but this goes for everybody. This can, this can be for five year olds up to 18 year olds. You see, you see pro players doing the drill. I just so did, I guess so. the easiest thing to do is practice the batting and, and stances and gripping the bat. Yeah. So same thing here. Again, we do have a home plate, but we wanted to show everybody that's easy. We bought these pros for two dollars. So we set up a little home plate right here, Matthew. We set up a little home plate here, the triangle. Batter up, batter up. So what we do is we don't really try to swing as much in the house because again, we right. mom, mom's killing everybody and breaking lamps and windows. And so what we'll, what I'll say is, Jude, set yourself up where you want to be when you're looking for a pitch to hit. That's a hitter's count, two, two one count, three zero count, uh, two zero count. So Jude's right in his comfort zone. He's looking for a fastball. So we have him set up right there. We bring the ball down the middle, and he just meets it. Okay, and gets through the ball. Got now you. I'll tell Jude, I'll tell Jude, give me your two strike approach. So Jude's going to get closer to the plate. He's going to move in closer, and we're going to protect the plate, maybe choke up on the bat a little bit. So we just talked to him about that and work on it. Okay. And then actually doing it becomes muscle memory, and then it just takes over. So uh, add real that's quickly here. We how, do, how do we, if we want to take part in a practice, how do I get a hold of you? Um, so you can go, we have a YouTube channel. Okay. Um, it's called The Chatter's Box. And we also continue to do Facebook Lives. You can find us at, okay. at, the, at the Chatter's Box. The Chatterbox. Uh, Chatter yeah, box. Yeah, Chatter's box. Yeah, C H A T T E R S box. All one word or two words. I'm sorry. It's a play on words. Obviously, the batter box. We made the Chatter's box. Okay. We'll put that right so, on our website as well, Fox29.com. Sure. Thank you so Thanks, much. Coach. Thanks, Coach. So awesome. Thanks for having us on. We appreciate Thanks, it. Thanks, Jude. It's great. Thanks. All right, raising funds to fight this virus.